What up? So, one of the things I noticed about rolling with Robbie, and my question for him is, um, he's always able and always on the offense when he's in his guard. So when Robbie plays, nothing scares me more than a big guy with a good guard, and Robbie is just that. So when I roll with Robbie, I'm very hesitant about entering, and, and when I do try to enter, I very rarely penetrate a defense. Um, what, what is your secret to, to being offensive from the closed guard as opposed to just being a counter puncher like myself? Sure, sure yeah. So um, there's a lot to that question. Let me focus on uh, just a couple different areas of it. Now, de depending on where Sonny is will determine my position and how I become offensive. So Sonny can be in a, uh, a, a couple of different positions. He can be here. Put your legs too far from me to catch. Right. Where my legs are too far, but your head's not too far, so you're leaning right. over. Basically, I don't have my hips under him, so I can't attack his legs as easy. We'll talk about attacking his legs from here. But what I like to do is get a grip on the back of the head, and I create this um, shield here. And I'm up on my toes, and my elbow's connected to my knee. This is a sick position because from here, Sonny only has two options. Actually, he has three options. One of the options is to try to barrel into me. And if he does, his hands will hit the mat because I'll skip it. From here, I'll get a guillotine. Or I'll take the back because his hands are on the mat. So I'm just doing this little skip. Um, when I see his head is in, is in vision, look, I'm not here when his head is down. He just will put me right on my back. Boom, difficult to stop. So. Big mistake, and this is so funny because I used to not realize I did this. I used to just teach to be here because I didn't realize I was doing that. And I would notice my students just getting crushed to their back. Mm -hmm. And then I just made this like realization, oh my God, I do this when they're there. So I'm giving them a catch-22 scenario. He either pushes into me, right, and which I, I skip and make him post, or as he backs away from me, I stand up. Technical stand-up, boom, 10-finger, guillotine, whatever you want to attack with. The thing is, is I will for sure be above him if he gets up. Now, this isn't always the case. I mean, sometimes I get here and he just like puts my elbow. Up. Yeah. So now, now, the, now he's hesitant to come in with his head. What's the next option? He's going to come in with his feet. Right, so now I'm going to attack this. So how do I attack the legs from here? Even though he's kind of far away, I'm going to use foot sweeps. I love foot sweeps. If I put my hook just behind Sonny's heel, he doesn't like that, but he doesn't necessarily have an avenue to escape. So he tries to, number wherever he brings his leg, the first thing he has to do is lift it off the mat. As he does, I pull it. Now look where I'm at. I pull it, now we're square. I can either control both legs, shoot my hips under and go for leg lock. Let's move this position this way. Or even better than that, I keep my hooks and I push his knees away. He's down. Another, so I'm constantly, when someone doesn't have their head near me and they're just coming in with their legs, or even if they're trying to keep both things away from me, legs and head, I'm here. I'm always hooking, trying to get square, trying to get control of both legs. And if I get this, really hard to stop if I push his knees. Another one is if he just steps one foot in the middle, so stand up. He starts trying to take this foot and step in. Try to do it again. <laughs> As he steps, <laughs> there's the back. It's a beautiful set of it works probably 90% of the time I try it. That, that would embarrass me greatly if that happened again. <laughs> Stand up again. I have to catch you when you're off, so I'm, I'm messing with you, I'm messing with you. Maybe you can get a pass that. Right. So you step in again. Step in again. <laughs> I really bug people when they don't give me their head. I'm constantly bugging them in whatever way I can. Do it again, step in. So he cannot stop me from taking his back if I do that. This causes people though, when I start foot sweeping them and messing with them, this way they go right to their knees. They go, oh, screw this fanny pass. <laughs> now I catch one. This is really cool because as he comes down, 
I go over under. Because I know he's going to come down before he does. Because I'm sleeping and he comes down, lock that arm. Boom, I'm here now. What time is it? Awesome. Yeah, so I'm constantly messing with people's feet. That's, it works constantly, keeps me on the offense. He gives me his head, I hang on. He gives me his legs, I sweep him until he's off balance. He gives me his head again, I hang on. So another thing too, if you give me your head, no, stand up. He gives me his head and his legs. Perfect, I'm here. Whatever you wanna do, you wanna walk backwards? <laughs> right? Here, maybe I catch it. Sometimes I'll do that. And with these foot sweeps, it's not, it's not cut and dry. Right. I'm not always gonna get right, right. the perfect scenario, but I will get something. I'll get him off balance. So head down. So he decides he wants to back up. I can sweep this out. So you have to bring your foot off the mat. Right now, I'm here. Look, I'll just get up with this leg. I'll usually finish this foot lock right here. I will. <laughs> so that's the thing about foot sweeps. It's not always, um, like I said, it's not always cut and dry what's going to happen, but I do know that if I kick your leg out from under you, you're not attacking me, which is always my turn then. And that's kind of the, um, my open guard philosophy. Um, and you have a DVD coming out, right? I do. I have a whole DVD on my open guard coming out right next week. Good. So we'll make sure to drop links for that when it comes. Yeah, for sure. Cool. There's actually six positions that I play in the open guard and all six go together. So you'll see that in the DVD for sure.